Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess Afia Sabrina Acapo, and wanted to give you a prophetic word that the Lord has spoken to my spirit on today, you guys. I was in deep prayer, and the Holy Spirit began to take over and take full charge and take full access. And the Holy Spirit spoke to me, I am anchoring you into your rightful position. I'm anchoring you into your rightful position. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the Spirit to affirm and confirm that this prophetic word is for you. And the song came to my spirit. And you guys, when you get a chance, go listen to this song. It's called My Soul is Anchored by Douglas Miller. My Soul is Anchored by Douglas Miller. And so, some rhema words came to my spirit. And God is saying, be steadfast. Be immovable, be hopeful, be faithful, be secure, know in your knowing that he has something better for you. Be unshakable, be unstoppable, be committed, be consistent, be intentional. Be intentional. Knowing that he is placing you in your rightful position, in your rightful place, and he is anchoring you in this season to higher ground, to higher level, to higher dimension. For old things have passed away, his word says, Behold, I shall do a new thing. Now it shall spring forth as pure gold. Hebrews 6 and 19. We have this hope as an anchor for the soul, firm and secure. So as I stated, the key words is being hopeful in him, knowing that you are already anchored in him. Be firm in him and be secure in him, knowing that this is your season to take your rightful place. This is your season to take your rightful position because your soul is anchored in the Lord. So Hebrews 6 and 19, we have this hope as an anchor for the soul is firm and secure. It enters the inner sanctuary behind the curtain. And I thank you, Holy Spirit. I just heard, heard this um, Holy Spirit say, you are coming from behind the veil. He is bringing you to the forefront. You are taking your rightful place. You are taking your rightful position. Your soul is anchored in the Lord. Know that you are steadfast. You are immovable. He's bringing you from the back of the line to the front of the line. You are taking your right position. You're taking your rightful place. You're taking your promotion by force. The kingdom suffers valid, but the valid take it by force. Your soul is anchored in the Lord. Know that he has his hands on you. You are up on the shadow of his wings. You are in his righteous right hand. You are seated in heavenly places at the right hand of the Father because your soul is anchored in him. And he is with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you because you sat at his feet, because you chose him first place. You said God first and every other thing last. He is sitting you in your rightful place, in your rightful position. And the time is now. This is the end time. This is the end season. This is your Kairos time. This is your Kairos moment. He is doing it now. 
Know that the Lord is selling you once again. He is securing you and longs for your total dependence and your total reliance to be totally and completely on him. Just like the song says, Of My Soul is Anchored by Douglas Miller. But by the word of God, I've got an anchor and it keeps me steadfast, immovable. But if the storm don't cease, but just in case the wind keeps on flowing in my life, my soul, my soul is anchored in the Lord. Psalms 62, 5 through 6, for God alone. Oh, my soul, wait in silence for my hope is from him. He only is my rock and my salvation and my fortress. I shall not be shaken. He only is my rock. He's my soul. He's my salvation. I shall not be shaken. I am unshakable. I am unmovable. I am steadfast. He is my fortress. He is my everything. He is our King of Kings. He's our Lord of Lords. He's our Alpha and our Omega, our beginning, our end, our first and our last, our food, we're hungry, our water, when we're thirsty. He's our everything. So continue being steadfast. Continue being unmovable. Continue knowing that he's going to keep you firm. Continue believing with faith and hope that he's going to keep you secure. Continue knowing that he's going to settle you. That he's going to finish the good work in you that he started in you. That he would never leave you nor forsake you. That he is anchoring you into your rightful position, into your rightful place. He has been preparing you all along for settlement. He has been preparing you all along for next level. He has been molding and shaping you for next level. This is your season of not only your soul being anchored, but he's upgrading you higher to a higher dimension, even spiritually. So Hebrews 6, 19 through 20, we have this as a sure and steadfast anchor of the soul, a hope that enters into the inner place behind the curtain where Jesus has gone as a forerunner. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. God wants you to know he has gone before you as a forerunner. He wants you to know he's running this thing. He has his hands on these things. He's taking care of everything from every aspect, every area, every array, every arena. And he's taking care of you. Once again, you are up on the shadow of his wings. You are in his righteous right hand. You are seated in heavenly places at the right hand of the Father. God has already gone before you and made your crooked places straight. He has already opened up the windows of heaven and poured out blessings that there is not room enough for us to receive it all. I am anchoring you into your rightful place, into your rightful position. In the mighty name of Jesus. So he is our forerunner on our behalf. Having become a high priest forever after the order of Melchizedek. There is a secret place where you can go and dwell in the secret place of Jesus, in his pavilion. His word says, he that dwells in the secret place of the most high God shall abide under the shadow of the almighty. They shall mount up with wings as an eagle, run and not be weary, walk and not faint. Take your rightful place, take your rightful position, for I am positioning you. And I just heard the Holy Spirit say, Take flight because you are about to mount up. You are about to soar high. I am anchoring you. I am selling you. You are seated in heavenly places. You are in his righteous right hand. And up on the shadow of his wings. And he says, build it. Because I've anchored it. Build your house upon a rock. 
that it's going to be rock solid. It's going to be firm. It's going to be secure. It's going to be unstoppable. It's going to be unmovable. It's going to be unshakable. I've got my hands on this thing. I have taken over. Know that your soul is anchored in him. He's got you in the palm of his hands. He's not going to turn you loose. Just stay at his feet and continue to stay in him with the right heart posture, knowing that your destiny, promise, and purpose is in him. Staying faithful and staying hopeful. Staying steadfast, staying unmovable, staying immovable. Knowing that your soul is anchored in him and he's the only one that can place you in position and place you in the place where you belong. You were born for this. This is your inheritance. Take your rightful place. Take your right position. Accept it. Build it. I am anchoring you into your rightful position. No one else can do it like I can. I am the all-powerful one. I am the all-knowing one. I am the all-sufficient one. I am building your house upon a work, upon a rock with a steady and a firm foundation. I am the God that changes not. Is there anything too hard for me? It is time to arise, shine, for your light has come and the glory of the Lord has risen upon thee. Isaiah 60 and 1. Arise, shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord has risen upon thee. I am anchoring you into your rightful position. I am anchoring you into your rightful place. This is that time. Now is that time. Now is that season. Now is that Kairos moment. Build it. Your house upon a rock. And God is going to firmly secure that thing. And it's going to hold together and it will not falter and it will not fall. I decree and I declare it is your portion in the mighty name of Jesus. And once again, God wants you to know it's going to be rock solid. I am holding this thing together. I have showed up for you in times past and I am showing up for you now. I would never leave you nor forsake you. I am placing you into your right position. I am placing you into your rightful place, your rightful promise, your rightful destiny, your rightful purpose. I have been preparing you all along. And if I go, I will definitely take you unto myself that where I am, ye may be also. Get ready. Because change is, has, get ready because change has come. Change is here. Settlement is here. Breakthrough is here. Deliverance is here. Your soul is anchored in the Lord. He is placing you in your rightful position. He is placing you in your rightful place. This is your season of promotion. I am anchoring you into your rightful place, into your rightful position. In the mighty name of Jesus. So know that you are steadfast. If God placed you there, you can't be moved. You are immovable. If God has his hands on it and he's in that circumstance, nobody can take it away from you. Remain hopeful. Remain faithful. Knowing that faith, it is the substance of things hoped for. It is the evidence of things that are not seen. Know that you remain com committed. Remain consistent. Remain intentional. Hebrews 11 and 1, now faith, it is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things that are not seen. I am anchoring this thing. I have my hands on this thing. I am in control of this thing. I have access, full control of this thing. I'm running this, hip, this, I'm running this ship, and your ship is going to sail. This is my house, and I'm building that house upon a rock, a steady, secure, and a firm foundation. I'm anchoring you into your rightful position. I'm anchoring you into your rightful place. It is yours for the taking. Receive it. Say yes to God. Because he is anchoring you for his best. And he wants his record to reflect. He wants his name to be displayed on public display. I am anchoring you. I am promoting you. I am positioning you into your rightful place. I pray that this word has encouraged as well as edified your life on today of I am anchoring you into your rightful place. I am anchoring you into your rightful position. 
this word is on fire for me. Like, I was in prayer and I'm like, wow, I just heard you, Holy Spirit. And when I listened to that song of My Soul is Anchored by Douglas Miller, you guys, when I tell you I felt that thing, just like I'm feeling this word, and I pray that you felt it in your spirit as well, because God is doing a new thing, and that new thing is springing forth now as pure gold. I'm telling you, he's moving. I am a living witness that he is moving. Trust in the Lord with all your heart, all your soul, and do not lean to your own understanding. But in all nine ways, acknowledge Jesus and he will direct your path. Allow him to order your steps. Know that the steps of a righteous man, the steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord. Know that your soul is anchored in him. He has promoted you. He is positioning you into your rightful place, into your rightful position. Up on the shadow of his wings, in his righteous right hand and seated in heavenly places at the right hand of the father. I am anchoring you into your rightful position in the mighty name of Jesus. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word has encouraged as well as edified your life on today. It has certainly enriched, enlightened, and excited my life on today. And it put some pep in my step. And I'm glad God has ordered my steps and he is doing the same for you in the mighty name of Jesus, according to his spirit, by the spirit, try the spirit. I'm excited about this word. I'm excited. I love each and every one of you guys. I'm constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And don't forget to hit that noti bell where you can be notified each time I upload a video. I am doing this thing. I have my hands on this thing. I am anchoring you into your rightful position, rightful promotion, rightful place. Now is the end time. Now is the end season. God has something better for you. All you got to do is remain hopeful, remain faithful, be steadfast, be immovable, be expected, be hopeful, unshakable, reliable, committed, consistent, and intentional, knowing that you are on a steady foundation, a house built upon a rock your soul is anchored in the lord he will never leave you nor forsake you know that anything with him is firm and sure to stay it is secure and in place know that your soul is anchored in the lord continue being faithful knowing that if you're faithful over a few things he will make you ruler over many keep your soul anchored in him don't stop. Keep moving. Keep moving forward because God has something better for you. And it's up into your rightful place, into your rightful position. Know that your soul is anchored in him. Once again, I love each and every one of you guys. I'm constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. It's about winning souls to Christ, being a representative of his image and of his name. Let his record reflect and of his character. I thank you, Lord. I honor you. I glorify you. I magnify you. I adore you. I exalt you. You are worthy to be praised. And I'm, I'm so thankful to be a disciple and to be a vessel to be used by you to bring forth your word with the oil of your anointing, to bring forth the word with your power, your grace, and your mercy. It gives me great pleasure and I honor you. And I thank you. Who are you guys? This one right here, I'm feeling this thing. My soul is anchored in the Lord. Your soul is anchored in the Lord. We are in, we are taking flight into our rightful position. We are taking flight into our rightful promise. We are taking flight into our rightful purpose. We are taking flight into our rightful place. Our soul is anchored. Listen to that song, you guys. My soul is anchored by Douglas Miller. Once you get a chance. My God from Zion. You guys know when I get to feeling it, that is it. God is just that awesome. Awesomely amazing. Remember to continue being intentional. Continue being committed. Continue being consistent. Don't stop. Keep moving forward. 
Preparation is the very thing that brings you to your breakthrough. Preparation is the very thing that brings you to your rightful place, your rightful position in, in, in Jesus. Knowing that your soul is anchored in him. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe. And until the next video, you guys, once again, I love you. I am constantly praying for you. Many, 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 many blessings to each and every one of you. Thank you for all that you do. Thank you for all of your messages, all your support, all of the seeds being sown. You guys, you are holding me down. You are holding me down. You are keeping me here, and I appreciate it. I don't take it lightly, and I thank each and every one of you. I love each and every one of you. Take care until the next video. We will talk soon. Like, share, and subscribe. God bless you. Take care. Bye-bye.